Hello, I'm Nigel Griffiths, I work at IBM in the UK. This is part five of a series using IBM Cloud Power VS for an ultra low price of two pounds a day to get access to AIX. In this video, we'll be looking at learning AIX system admin, and this is the reason why we actually started up this whole series. This is the series so far, six parts. Six is already out because that was an easy video to make. Part five took a lot longer because there's an associated website. I'll get to that in a moment. So with PowerVS, we have cheap access to AX to practice our AX systems admin skills. Now we have to keep this simple. I don't have resources to write massive four week courses and everything you ever need to know about AX. And each person will start from a different place. Maybe you just want to have a go at this part of AX that you haven't used in the past and make sure you've got a grip for how it actually works. And you could do some dangerous stuff that you couldn't do on your production server. So I developed a web page referring to mostly existing material like there's an AX in focus youtube series of 32 from me and you could use those to get familiar with the subject and then we'll give you some hints and tips and perhaps sample commands you might want to try so i created an ibm support article on this there's the two links in here it goes to the same page whether you like typing in lots of words or whether you want to type in a number just remember 644 1997 644 1997 so what do you get when you go to that website? Well, there's some eye candy with the AX icons, the two latest ones. Then there's a series on the AX best bits. There's some articles you can go and read about that. The 32 really great features of AX, and I got people to vote on them when we found which was the most popular. This is an excellent way to remind yourself of some of the parts of AX you may want to explore. Then there is the AX manual pages, the commands, reference manuals, of course, but lots of other manuals that you might find useful on particular topics around managing AIX. Following that are the AX PDF books. Some of these are four to 500 pages looking at really in-depth topics for you to learn about. Then there are details of this YouTube series in case you come across the article before the YouTube videos. And I have some more plans, so it's worth keeping up to date. Then there's lots of sections on various topics that have the YouTube video and then some example commands. The first one's a little unusual because you have to know the VI editor to be a systems administrator on AX. There's no getting around that. So there's a quick primer on that. Then there's some information about the 101 basics. This is for the AX basic user commands, which are the Unix user commands. And because Linux was written looking at the Unix POSIX standard, they're also exactly the same as the Linux standard user commands. And that's the point of this part. And there's a whole series of sections for the primary part of AIX video, and then some commands you can try. Notice a couple of these you can't do with PowerVS. Active memory expansion, AME, requires access to the HMC. So does the LKU, or now called LU command, for dynamically updating the AIX kernel. Also, NIM could be tricky. I'm not sure how you do the node conditioning to get it to talk to the NIM server. Anybody got any ideas? I've got a few things that I want to release soon. The replacement for NMON is NJMON, and that needs InfluxDB and Grafana. They run on AIX. I already have an article out on that, but I need to double check that it's okay when you're in the PowerVS environment. There's also a performance class that we use at technical universities teaching you about disks, memory, and CPUs. We can include that too, perhaps. Now, this article is a work in progress. Yes, it's a bit rough in places. It particularly needs some information about the hints and tips and some command examples. Maybe some of them are actually in the video. So if you watch the video, write down what the commands are that I've used. I like to think of this more as a community project. Us AIX gurus can try and help out some of the newbies get up to speed. Please help me improve this and send me email with the details in plain text. Please don't send me a Microsoft document. I have to spend hours disinfecting it. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching Learning AIX Admin Skills on PowerVS at very inexpensive prices. If you learned something or enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up. Part 6, Upgrading AX with Suma, nice simple tool, then that video is already out. Thanks for watching.